Here we go. It's the place fun never ends. Take your pick and click. Ned and friends. Welcome to Ned Shorts. Hey there, my friend. It's good to see you again. Remember us, Evan and Ned? We're the guys who like to play with words through laughter and learning. That's because word play always helps to get our go brains going and growing. Speaking of which, you ever have your mind going a mile a minute when thinking about words that start with the same sound or letter like Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers or Sally sold seashells by the seashore? Ned, when you group a bunch of words together that start with the same sound or consonant like P and S, that's called alliteration. Yep, it sure is. And you know what our favorite form of alliteration is? Tongue twisters. As a Ned's Mindset Mission performer, I often use tongue twisters to help me warm up my voice and get energy into my body before the show. Remember how we mentioned our go brains earlier? Well, our brain coordinates muscle memory the same way it processes how the words we say are articulated, how they're pronounced. So when we practice tongue twisters, we're not only helping our speech and diction, but we're also helping our coordination and movement. Here's one that helps me do both, especially right before I go on stage to perform with my buddy Ned. <clears throat> Yesterday, yet the Yeti yelled yo from the yard for his yellow yo-yo. Try it with me. Yesterday, yet the Yeti yelled yo from the yard for his yellow yo-yo. Now let's try it twice as fast. Yesterday, yet the Yeti yelled yo from the yard for his yellow yo-yo. How'd you do? Ned, what do you think? You want to try some more? Good idea. We guarantee these tongue twisters will help you both laugh and learn. Let's put them on our handy dandy whiteboard and check them out. Here's an easy one to start with to literally and figuratively whet our alliterative appetites. Ice cream. You scream. We all scream for ice cream. Now let's do it twice as fast. Ice cream, you scream. We all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream. We all scream for ice cream. All right, let's try something a little harder now. It's pretty challenging, so if you get stuck, just remember what the N in Ned's name stands for. Never give up. Here we go. Say it with me. Betty bought some butter, but the butter was bitter. So Betty bought some better butter to make the bitter butter better. All right, let's try it twice as fast. Betty bought some butter, but the butter was bitter. So Betty bought some better butter to make the bitter butter better. And why not? I'm gonna try it as fast as possible now. Betty bought some butter, but the butter was bitter. So Betty bought some better butter to make the bitter butter better. Woohoo! we did it. How'd you do? Did your tongue get tantalizingly twisted with all that awesome alliteration? Or did you find sweet sounding success like Ned and I? I hope you'll be ready to laugh and learn for our next adventure together. Speaking of which, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to all of our Ned videos, and we certainly hope to see you again soon. Until then, as Ned and I like to say, keep laughing and keep learning. Bye!